All right, welcome to Hogan Racing, guys. This is an exciting video. We're drifting Dago Saito's Lamborghini Murcielago, purpose-built for drifting. And then we're also on a brand new track release by 3 Noon. It's called Virginia City. There's a lot going on. I thought it'd be really cool to do it at night, too. It's kind of like a, a post-apocalyptic uh, kind of track. So, or like area, rather. It's not even a track. But without further ado, let's see what everything is about. So left hand drive tripped me out a little bit. All right, I'm just gonna, we're gonna do a drift tour, so I might kind of stop and go, oh, that picture is creepy as hell. Oh, it's like a drive through theater? It is! This is so tight. And look at, this is so realistic. It even has a little speakers. That's like old school. I don't even, I've seen it, but I don't know if I've actually done one where we use the speakers like that. All the ones I've gone to are FM stations. But that is creepy as hell. All right, let's get to shredding. Let's see what this thing's all about. Oh my God. This car is crazy. Okay, so we got a little, a little diner. Diner action. Yo, this thing feels awesome. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> That is like a creepy little broken down car. We got a motel right, oh my God. This thing feels great. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. I did a couple tuning adjustments, added camber in the rear, locked up the diff, and got rid of, uh... I also got rid of uh, any arrow, like impact. This is kind of crazy. So rather than just like a wall to close off the track, it's like a, it, it actually looks like realistic. I love that, that like really creates some realism. Yo, look at this creepy little factory. Oh, we gotta we gotta get a wall scrape on there. I don't know if that was close or not. I'm still getting used to this car. Oh, can we go in here? It's like kind of some Germatonic. This is so sick. Look at the silo over here. Okay, this car does feel kind of loose. I'm gonna I'm gonna reset it just in case it is broken. So just as a side note, for you guys who like really practicing the art of drifting, I love like finding something and then trying to like get my nose real close and like keep going all around and around and around. So that's kind of what I'm practicing here. Oh, look at this creepy little town. Yo, anybody in here? Oh, this is where we want to be. I have no idea if his real life Mercilago feels this good, but like, I love this thing. Out wide to the curb there. Okay, we gotta go back in though. This is so crazy. Ooh. Okay. What the hell is this? Yo! Hold on a second. That's a UFO. <laughs> I'm finna abduct my ass. We can't get over there though. No! Wait, wait. I see another little road here. Okay. 
Oh my god. What? No, 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 no! Okay, we got a little bug here. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna we're gonna go drive through here real quick. I don't think it's a good idea, but I feel like this is UFO territory. I feel like we're <gasps> Oh my god, you guys. Look at that thing! You guys need like a jump or something? Okay. I wanna go do one last little rip through this area. This area's kinda calling my name. This little area over here has a really good flow. Right by all the radioactive shit. You guys see that sign? <laughs> okay, so like on the left foot brake subject, I wanted to left foot brake there for whatever reason. But I waited until I saw if it was necessary or not, and it wasn't. So I didn't left foot break. Easy as that. <laughs> Too much. Alright, let's get a 360 though. 360 for the boys. <laughs> yeah, that was a little messy. Oh, that's super messy. Damn it. See here, I'm gonna left foot break, kind of wrap myself around here. So it made sense to use it there. This thing's hella loose. It's a good time though. So that was just handbrake there to kind of extend myself out because I initiated into that real slow. Savage fifth gear upshift. That's so good. Oh, oh no. All right, guys. Well, this was super fun. This comment below what you guys liked, what you didn't like. Did you like drifting at night? It was super fun for me. I don't know if it's as enjoyable to watch though, so I'd love to get some feedback. Please go check out our most recent announcement. It's literally like the biggest thing of my life. I'm so freaking excited. And if you guys want to support us, Definitely go to HaugenRacing.com, get yourself some merch, and we will see you guys in a couple days. Peace out.